Good morning and happy 4th of July from Disney's Polynesian Village Resort. We are going to do all kinds of stuff today. First thing we have to do, we've got to go to Ohana to have some breakfast. All you can drink pog juice, all you can eat all kinds of other different foods, or all you care to eat. Then we are going to go to Hollywood Studios, I believe, do some rides, check it out. And we have lunch at Woody's Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Very excited for that. I had it once. It was delicious. Jen and Jackson has not had it. So excited to see what their thoughts are. Then we're going to try to make it to Epcot for the fireworks because they do, that's the only, the 4th of July is the only day that Epcot does a 4th of July fireworks. So Magic Kingdom does it the 3rd and the 4th and Epcot does it just on the 4th. So that's why we watch Magic Kingdoms on the 3rd and then we watch Epcot's on the 4th. So I don't know, it's going to be a very exciting day. Let's go get some breakfast. I just walked outside. I haven't looked at the footage yet, but I want to see how humid it was. Huh, not too humid. My camera doesn't seem to have fogged up very much. So that's good. A beautiful day, not a cloud in the sky. Glass, still water. We can see the turtles are out right now. Swimming around. And we're headed over here to the Great Ceremonial House, which is where Ohana is. All right, so once again, we are upstairs in the lobby and we checked in for Ohana over here, and then we will be going over there. And this is a character breakfast. All right, we're headed into Ohana now. There goes Lilo. Oh, there she is. Okay. So and there's Stitch over there too. Oh, I love it. All right, so we got our seat at Ohana, and look, they gave us a card with Pluto and Mickey and no, Lilo and Stitch. And they signed it on the back. I didn't realize. They I knew that Lilo and Stitch were here, but I didn't know that Mickey and Pluto were here. Right? That makes this like... Are they wearing their little like Hawaiian outfits? I hope so. Oh man, I hope so too. Yeah, it feels very much like Alani. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I wore my Alani shirt the other day. Yeah. Should have been. I'm wearing a Fort Wilderness shirt today. I feel like a fraud. <laughs> this plate full of... Oh, they're, are we already bringing them out? I, I was going to say. <laughs> well, we haven't even, haven't even said anything yet. Look at this stack of Mickey waffles over here. So here's that everything that is from the all-you-care-to-eat menu. Pineapple coconut breakfast bread, yes. Breakfast skillet, scrambled eggs and pork. And then we've got fried potatoes, Mickey-shaped waffle, Mickey and Stitch-shaped waffles. Oh! Then you can do, for an extra charge, specialty beverages. The Lapu Lapu. A wasabi Bloody Mary? Oh, that sounds, that sounds terrible. very spicy. <laughs> and then also for an for a extra charge, you can get the Moana smoothie, the Stitch smoothie, or the Lilo smoothie. Oh, okay. Strawberry and chocolate is the Lilo one. Amazing. Watermelon, cherry, and guava for Moana. That sounds good. The watermelon's throwing me. The cherry is actually really throwing me. Oh. Not sure about it. Lilo showed up. We're also here with Nick, the theme park dad, and his group. Oh, is Jackson? Space. Oh, there's Lilo. You want to go say hi to Lilo? Oh, say hi. Oh. Well, it's Nani. Can we take a picture? Oh, careful. Getting Thank getting you so I'm sorry about my shadow, but here's what they brought out so far. They brought out some fresh fruit, and this is their pineapple bread. It looks very sweet. It's like a, like a Danish. They also brought these, like, we call them puzzle pieces. I don't know what their real name is, but we brought these to keep the kids occupied. Yeah, they're like little, they're like hard, hard plastic, and you can build with them. Thanks, buddy. They also brought us some pog juice, passion fruit, orange, and guava. Look, Jackson. Stitch has showed up. Jackson, Jackson, who's behind you? Jackson. He's still Stitch, building. Stitch is only here for a minute, buddy. Oh, Stitch is going to build with you. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> He's only here for a minute, bud. Oh no, Stitch is getting angry. Oh no! He can't do it. <laughs> His fingers are a little too big. Uh, oh no, buddy! Oh, Jackson, dear. look, you gotta help Stitch! Him. You gotta help him! <laughs> what do you do, Jackson? Jackson, help him! You wanna, you wanna show him how to, oh, he's telling you which one to use next. He says, use, use that one. <laughs> He's the creative director. <laughs> wow. What did you build? Good job, buddy. What is nice. it? Yeah, what is it? Hey, bud, do you want to see if we can take a picture with Stitch? I'm still building. Have, he has to meet, he has to meet <laughs> a lot of other people. We can take a pause from building, yeah, buddy. because he's got a lot of other friends to meet. So we want to make sure that we give, we give him time to meet everybody, right? 
Can I take a picture with Stitch then? Oh, um, I. Oh, you want to do oh, it now? Okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> that is the best oh. hug ever. Stitch was trying to eat you. That's the best hug. Did Stitch try to eat your nose? Can, I, can we all take a picture with Stitch? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. your brother wants to. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> is it a Mickey dance party? I didn't know there was a dance party here. Whoa! Say cheese! Oh my goodness. Nice. I love that picture. Hi, Mickey. You recognize Mickey? When you're looking at his flower, one of those blade necklaces, it's very cool. Very impressive. Oh my god, they gave you a little kiss. <laughs> Look at how excited Jackson is for Mickey. We had like one piece of the of the bread and he's, that's it. Yeah, we're on. Oh, they're doing what's called the Ohana Aloha Celebration. Oh, we're going to go on a Hawaiian roller coaster ride. Here comes Lilo. Oh, Stitch comes through with the style. Oh, Mickey also. <laughs> they brought us some Mickey and Stitch waffles. Do you want Mickey or Stitch waffles? There's Stitch. We got some biscuits, some more waffles, some potatoes, some eggs. Pineapple glazed Hawaiian ham. Pineapple glazed Hawaiian ham and some sausage. Wow, there's a lot of stuff. Look at the, look at the glaze on that ham. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just want to show you guys the face that Stitch was making on the waffle. He's like, ah! <laughs> that, exactly, yeah. There's Pluto, buddy. Whoa! <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get a picture. All right. Yeah! I went with one of the extra charged drinks. I got the Lilo smoothie. This is chocolate and strawberry. Yeah. It's beautiful. We could eat that flower. Can you? I yeah. hope you should. I'm not going to. Okay. So we are all done with breakfast. It was delicious. Everything that we had was very, very good. The characters were awesome. Stitch put in some extra time with Jackson and that was, that's Disney magic right there. That was so cool. And then uh, at 10.30, which is in just about 10 minutes, there's gonna be a flyover. Like the Air Force is doing a flyover over top of the Magic Kingdom. Uh, I think it's gonna be the Thunderbirds. I'm very excited to see that. So let's head out to, we're trying to go down to the beach, see what happens. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if they're gonna be easy to see down there, if there's gonna be a ton of people down there, I'm not sure. So let's go try to find out. Okay, so they, they just flew over. It was uh, just a couple of them and the refueler. I don't know if that was the actual like final product. Maybe that was just like the first pass, like a test pass to like just map out the area, see what it looks like. But yeah, there was just a ton of people down by the beach. So I think we're gonna head up closer to the Great Ceremonial House and see if we can get a better view if they do another flyover. We're not sure. But whereas the people are kind of like standing around a little bit to see if there's another one. So they are coming back by again. They're further back now. Yeah, Jackson, look. <laughs> Oh, okay, there you go. There, there was like four of them that flew over top of right down Main Street. It would have been really cool to see in the park, but I liked it here because you could get a good view of them coming in because we're a little bit like higher up, kind of looking down at, at Magic Kingdom. So it was kind of like neat to see them from far away making their approach up. And then when they came past us, there was one when it went past the, the sun, like a little like, shh, like a little contrail came off of its wingtip. That was neat looking. Right now, we're going to head back to the room and we are going to kind of regroup, get the baby changed, put on some sunscreen. Then we're gonna to try to go to Hollywood Studios today because we do have a reservation for Roundup Rodeo Barbecue, another all you care to eat restaurant. It's gonna be a day of eating. We're also gonna to try to get in some rides at Hollywood Studios. So let's go do a quick regroup. So now, originally we we're gonna to go to Hollywood Studios, but we decided it's hot out. 
Might as well cool off first. We're going to head down to the pool we for are, a quick minute. We're still going to go to Hollywood Studios, but first the pool. Yeah, but first the pool. Yeah, I want to see the slide. I feel like slide. that should be a shirt. <laughs> but first the but pool. But first the pool. So the last time we stayed here, and I'll link that down below where we stayed in the bungalows. It was fantastic. But we didn't actually go to the pool once. Right. The whole time we were here. So today's the day. Before we go, though, I wanted to show you something that I missed during the tour. A hidden hey hey. You showed this... it in the video. Did I say it? You didn't say it, but you did show it. Yeah, he's like right behind the coffee because that like that fits hey hey doesn't it? No, oh, he loves coffee. He looks like he loves coffee. All right, so we're headed out to the pool. We had to get wristbands, so we had to go up to the front desk to get wristbands. Mm -hmm. it's for she the goes, do you have? She goes, do you have wristbands? I said, I have my magic band. Yeah. She's like, no. she's like, no, get out of here. <laughs> Not good enough. Yeah. So I think they're anticipating a lot of people coming to the beach today. I think so for the fireworks. Yeah. So let's see here. This is all the same stuff that I showed you guys before. Still name that. Stay tuned. I don't think I could do it. 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. a beach party. Ooh, good times. As we're starting to walk down, the pool is definitely very crowded. Happy Fourth of July from the Polynesian Village Resort. Yeah, good job, buddy. Good job, buddy. All right, now it's time to go down the slide. There's a view from up high. You ready to go down? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, you are. All right, Jackson, now we just got to wait till this turns green, okay? Do you want to sit in there or do you want to get in when it turns green? Okay. All right, it's green, buddy. Go ahead. Go for it. Bye, have fun. You okay? Yeah. Yeah? I like it. You liked it? <laughs> did you get water in your goggles? Yeah, I did. Oh. Did you like it though? It was fun? Yeah. yeah, it was. All right, let me go. Let's go check on mommy and baby brother, and then maybe mommy can go down behind you or in front of you. So we are all done with the pool. Now it's time for us to head to Hollywood Studios because we have a reservation for Roundup Rodeo Barbecue at 3.30. It's about two right now. So I think we might have enough time to like get there, ride one ride, go do some barbecue, then ride some more rides afterwards. I'm very excited for this. This is a, turning out to be a very, very fun day. It's starting to look a little bit cloudy. Hopefully the rain holds off. If not, it'll still be a great day. Let's go to Hollywood Studios. Hey, right, here we are, Disney's Hollywood Studios. We've made it. We stopped in the gift shop to catch some AC and I haven't noticed this before. It's a Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway set of ears with Chuby. The good news is there is basically nobody here at Hollywood Studios because they don't have any sort of firework offering tonight. So the only two places that do special 4th of July fireworks are Magic Kingdom and Epcot. So Hollywood Studios, not a lot of people. Mickey Minnie's Runaway Railway on the app says it's 15 minute wait. Let's go check it out. Look at this. No exterior queue for Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. We just go straight inside. I love it. I feel like we should do how many hidden Mickeys can you find? Ready, go. Look at these people just running into a cartoon. Little do they know cartoon physics are going to apply. Look at that, in the grain of the wood, it says Mickey. Would you call that a hidden Mickey? I know. Somebody's about to ride Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. First time. First time. All right, Mr. Sun, I'm gonna need you to cool it down outside. Here comes Mickey and Minnie. I don't want to get a hot dog today. This is a very 4th of July ride, isn't it? You know, it's like 3D. Uh -oh. Why 
Why is there a tornado? We made it through the tornado. Oh no! Are you guys okay? Oh look, there they are. Uh, oh no! We've angered the volcano! Oh no! Oh, we're getting flushed. 1901. Watch out, Donald! Oh no, we're going into the factory. Somebody turn the switch. Oh, we did it. Very nice, everybody. We made it. In CD. We're in the front now. Head out and relax and ride around the park. Oh, there it says Mickey again down there. Oh, Shuby had babies. All right, we came right behind Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, and we're heading into Toy Story Land. And just past Woody there, that's where we're going to eat. Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Quite a few people waiting to get inside. All right, here we are. Welcome Rodeo fans to Roundup Rodeo Barbecue. Ooh, there he is. Rex and Buzz ride again. We got some of the characters from Midway Mania too. Trixie with a Jesse riding on top of her. There's so many things to look at. This is like a board game up above us. Oh, and that's where the characters from uh, Midway Mania came from? Is from a board game, maybe? I like this flavored popcorn. These guys are fun. They seem very excited. The kitchen's inside of a milk container. I like how this is like a suction cup arrow stuck into the wall over here. And that's what's holding up the lights. Jackson, what's happening? The roughest, toughest, rider in the west, <laughs> do the dino! Here are three salads they got delivered. Root and toot and tomato salad, cucumbers, red pickle, onion, white balsamic vinaigrette, Rex's romaine and kale salad, apple, dried cranberries, pumpkin seeds, green goddess dressing, and then Wheezy's watermelon salad with fresh torn mint. So we just got our biscuits and we got our salads. I just tried the biscuit by itself. It's so buttery and flaky and delicious and like there's some salt on the top. It's so good. But then Haley was walking by and said, you know what you have to do? It's a, it's a rodeo favorite. Take your biscuit, put some brisket on it, and then add a little bit of the pepper jelly. Make a sandwich. I'm gonna try that. That sounds really good. All right, so speaking of the biscuit, this is the Prospector's Homemade Cheddar Biscuit with sweet pepper jelly. That's how she said it when she came to the table. She said sweet pepper jelly. And um, I have to say, the Prospector makes some really good biscuits. The jelly, I actually like it. I like the sweet pepper jelly on the biscuit. Not everybody has been a fan of it, but I actually kind of like it. It's like nice and cool, obviously sweet. It tastes like like bell pepper, like a sweet bell pepper, but it's like it's kind of like a sweet and sour sauce almost. And um, these biscuits are amazing. Like they are so like cheesy and buttery and flaky and delicious. I love it. Great way to start. We'll move. Where is it? I know I looked in the wrong room somewhere. That's Andy. Oh, Look at the baby. Look at the baby. Buckle. I can't find it. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> you're moving too much. Andy's going to know that you're not the real toy. Wow. Everybody did it. Nice work, everybody. So they gave us some little hints or some little Easter eggs. So of course, there are hidden Mickeys around. But then if you look up at the expiration date, here of this milk carton. That's the year and the date that Toy Story 1 came out. They also told us that on this puzzle wall, the Green Army men couldn't find a few pieces. They lost some of them. And that if you look around in Toy Story Land, you might be able to find them. We'll have to keep an eye out for these puzzle pieces as we walk around Toy Story Land. All right, so our, our food came to the table. Our meats came to the table. We got a platter of the house smoked meats, evil doctor smoked ribs, buttercups beef brisket, 
There's a sausage in my boot, fire grilled pork sausage, and barbecue chicken with style. Oh no, what is the style? Oh, okay. <laughs> we also got our sides, so we got the mean old potato salad, homestyle red skin potatoes. The campfire roasted vegetables, which is zucchini, squash, roasted red peppers, and broccoli. We also got the Slinky Dogs Mac and Cheese. That's how she said it. Slinky Dogs Mac and Cheese. So it's like spirally mac and cheese with crushed up goldfish on top. And we also got the fried pickles, the force field fried pickles. They don't have ranch here, but they did give us a side of the green goddess dressing, which is really good actually. She did say these have a bit of a kick to them. Introduce the roughest, toughest, rider of the West. Who? Do the dino. And do the broad the one you have all been waiting for. Is it Rex? Party Taurus Rex. Oh! Oh, they're all dancing. <laughs> they're all dancing. Are you dancing too? Oh, hurt my hip. All right, I tried some of the pepper jelly on the brisket on a cheese biscuit. It's, um, it was okay. I think I would prefer barbecue sauce. I'm gonna put some barbecue sauce on this. Some sweet barbecue sauce. All right, so we got dessert and Jackson immediately bit right into Forky's head. Oh no! <laughs> he looks so concerned. You know what, it's okay, because he's trash. That's true. <laughs> we got chocolate soaked pie. We got apple pie. We got lemon blueberry cheesecake. Yeah. You enjoying that cupcake, bud? Where is it? <laughs> Oh, yeah, you can try some of mine. No, I, I wanted to show you this. So this is my uh, lemon blueberry cheesecake, but I wanted to show you the layers. They've got like the, the graham cracker crust on the bottom, the actual cheesecake, the layer of blueberry, um, it's like jam almost with actual blueberries, and then the lemon cream on top, like lemon curd. Mm. It's really good. I love this. You should I, try this, it tastes like an apple pie. I don't really love apple pie. Uh oh. Okay. Yeah. Let's give a nice big Andy's Yard salute for our Green Army Patrol who keep us safe around these parts. I think this is special for the 4th of July. I don't know if I've ever heard that. Yeah. It's like a like a thank you veterans type. Uh, oh, for the 4th of July? Yeah, for the 4th of July. Oh. I don't, we didn't hear that the last time we were here. Oh no, I was gonna ask you if you heard all of these. I heard all of them except for that one. It's Duke Cabo! I don't know, folks. That's a lot of cattle to clear. Think he can make the jump? Did he make it? Yes, he Canada! Oh, he did it! Yes, he Canada! <laughs> all right, after dinner. Time to head into Toy Story Mania. Only a 15 minute wait. Yeah, there's nobody in line. I feel like it's just a 15 minute wait to walk through the line. Coming up on Mr. Potato Head. I like how he's staring everybody Ooh. down. How's it going, Mr. Potato Head? Say hi. No, we don't. Oh, he's like, no. All right, Jackson, you ready? You're gonna win or am I gonna win? Last time Jackson won. All right, I'm not gonna film it. I'm gonna see how much of a high score I can get. I'm really going for it, Jackson. Are you ready? <laughs> I got 182,000. I'm this cat. So Jackson got 39,000. He's just one below me. 182,000. What was the highest of the day? 100, best in vehicle was 155. But I got 182. I don't understand. Show me, buddy. Do a big splash. Big splash, buddy. Big splash. <laughs> Look at him. A true legend. Bo, not even flinching from the rain. You're doing great, bud. Proud of you. Uh, it rained right as soon as we got out of the uh, Midway Mania. It started pouring. So we purchased some ponchos. We made it out to the front of the park. It stopped raining now. So we're headed back to the Polynesian to drop off Jen, Jackson, and Oliver. And then I'm headed out to Epcot for the 4th of July fireworks. All right, just dropped the family off at the Polynesian. They're going back to the room. Relax, get ready for bed. Probably gonna watch the fireworks from the room for 4th of July again. I am walking over to TTC from the Polynesian to get on a monorail to head to Epcot to watch the fireworks from there. It's gonna be a fun night all around.
Alright, it was fairly quick to get into Epcot through the turnstiles. There was just a large rush of people as soon as I got here. I think everybody's getting the same idea. Come here and watch the fireworks. Our first stop is Connections for the Liege Waffle. Hopefully they still have some. Alright, we got our Liege Waffle. It's beautiful. America. Alright, so we've got about an hour before the fireworks happen. So we're heading to our spot. Then we're going to eat our Liege Waffle there. You can see people are already starting to line up for the fireworks. Getting their spots. All right, we got our spot for Epcot Forever first. And then at the end of Epcot Forever, they're gonna launch fireworks off the America Pavilion back here. All right, now we follow the crowd to the exit of Epcot. It smells like fireworks and hot dogs. I don't know why it smells like hot dogs over here, but it does. We're thinking those fireworks are either celebrations or maybe there's a JW Marriott kind of that way. Yeah, those, these are Magic Kingdom's fireworks. We were trying to figure out what those are over there. It was 4th of July, there's just fireworks everywhere. Spaceship Earth lit up red, white, and blue. We'll get a better view of it once we get a little bit closer. The monorail ground effects have been changing from red, white, and blue. I don't know if it'll change again. Yeah, there goes red. Look at that. <laughs> Good times. Let's see it's white. Change to blue. Let's see if we catch a change into red. There it goes. Brilliant. There it is. There's Spaceship Earth lit up with its American flag colors. Looks really cool. I wonder if they do a show. I don't know if they do. Well, I feel like we would have seen it. We've been walking out of Epcot for kind of a while now. It's like 9.45 right now. All right, let's get on the monorail, head back to the TTC, and then walk over to the Polynesian. I just realized that a pretty long line for the monorail. I can just take a bus back to the Polynesian. So, heading to the buses. Seems easier, right? Oh, Disney, you're killing me. What are you doing to me? You want me to take a monorail, don't you? Dang. All right, had to go back through security. Now I'm back on the other side of security going to the monorail again. Uh, but security's closed down now, so if I had done that maybe like, I don't know, 10 minutes later, I don't think I would have been able to do this. I don't know I don't know what the process would have been at that point. Thought for sure I could take a bus. I don't know why it's such a busy night. They should probably also be running buses. All right, what a day. Just walking into the Polynesian right now. What a fantastic day. A lot of really good food. We got on some rides. We got to see jets fly over. We got to see a ridiculous fireworks display. Like, I, I just, it always blows my mind to come to 4th of July at Epcot 
most years. It just seems like they're trying to set some sort of world record for the most amount of fireworks set off at one time. It's so ridiculous. I love it and you just like feel it in your chest pounding. Man. But tomorrow we check out. We head back home tomorrow. It's been a fun little staycation. We had a really good time. The kids loved it. I loved it. Jen loved it. We had a, the room, the view. It was awesome. But tonight we sleep one more time in this room and we head home. So all in all, a fantastic day. With that being said, we are off. We'll see y'all tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.